Hello everybody, so in today's video I'm gonna show you how to download and install World Edit for Minecraft Java version 1.21.5 So, let's get started The first thing you want to do is go to your web browser and I will have links in the description if you need them But all you want to do here is go to your search bar and search up mod print like so and once you enter you will see moderns.com here Now just click on the moderns link here and this will bring you to the modern homepage. So all you want to do here is go to the top of the website to discover content and you want to go down to mods. Now all you want to do is go to search mods and you want to type in world edit like so. Now all you want to do is click the world edit name here and this will bring you to the world edit homepage on modwinf. So now all you want to do is go to versions and from there you want to go to game versions and you want to select 1.21.5 here you will have all these server versions and here you will have the client versions. So all you want to do here is just click the green download button for these versions. Okay, so once you have the mod, all you want to do is go to a new tab and you want to go ahead and search up Fabric Minecraft like so. Once you enter, you'll see FabricMC.net here. Just click the link and this will bring you to the Fabric homepage. Now all you want to do is click the blue download button and then you want to click the blue download for windows button here and from there you will have fabric installer so all you want to do here is just close your web browser and you want to go to your file explorer to go ahead and access your downloads folder now all you want to do is double click the fabric installer and this will open up a window here and from there all you want to do is make sure that minecraft 1.215 is selected and if it is just do install ok and close and now all you want to do is open up your Minecraft launcher and with the Minecraft launcher we will be able to add the world edit mod to the mods folder. So basically if you have fabric loader 1.20.5 here you can go to installations here on the top. From there you can go ahead and hover over fabric loader and go to the folder icon. Now all you want to do is find a mods folder here. You want to double click it. From there you want to go to your downloads folder. You want to select and find what I didn't copy it. You want to go to the top left arrow to go back to your previous folder and you want to click paste. What you want to do here is copy paste world edit mod to dot Minecraft mods. If you have this you can go to the Minecraft launcher, you can go to play, make sure fabric loader is selected and click play and this will just open up Minecraft automatically. Okay. And once we have Minecraft here, we have Fabric here, all you want to do is go to a single player world for example. And I'll just make a new world because we'll be using world edits so modifying all the blocks. And basically with world edit you can do quite a lot of things. But for samples, basically you can just do, well, the wooden axe here, that's just a classic item. Of course you can select any other item if you really wanted to. But for example, if you select this, you can see in chat that we selected a position and we do this again, we selected this position here and if we do slash slash replace hashtag solid, so any solid block with diamond blocks we will see that all these solid blocks have been replaced and the air ones are not and another pretty cool thing you can do with world edit is all the brushes for example we can just do slash slash brush we can do sphere, we can do diamond blocks again, and we can make it the maximum in this configuration, which is six. And here we can just go ahead and paint using spheres. Of course, there is other items as well you can use, like other uh, objects, shapes. But that's just a really simple example of how to actually use world edit. So yeah, so that is world edit working for Minecraft Java. 1.21.5 so yeah if you like today's video make sure to like and subscribe and see you for the next one bye